going to show a short video how to uh, fix a picture, which you probably had happen. You try to take a picture of a group of people, and there's always somebody with their head or with their eyes closed, or uh, or uh, their hair's out of place, or something bad. So here's an example. We have two girls that look like they took a picture on the beach. Uh, this is picture number one, layer number one. Um, the layer number zero on the bottom. She looks good, her eyes are open, but her hair is kind of out of place, her hair is out of place. So what you want to do is get this face on that picture, okay? Um, you know how to do this already because you've learned how to use layer masks. So this is really just another handy use for layer masks. Uh, what I'm going to do is, uh, let's just start by leaving this one turned off with the eyeball. Make sure you're on layer one, turn on a layer mask. Okay, nothing changed, which tells me I always forget. So white means it's not invisible. So if you paint black on here, you're gonna make it invisible. Since this is the bad picture, I'm gonna paint black. Okay, if you need to change the colors, remember you have this little dot, default dot icon right here. Okay, you can, you can uh, go black to black and white in case these colors are something else from over here. Since we wanna paint black, I'm going to click on this little arrow, which will switch black to the foreground. I'm going to pick a paintbrush. That's way too big of a paintbrush, so I'm going to use my left bracket and make it small. And then I'm also going to go up here and make it a fuzzy edged paintbrush because it'll blend better. Okay, and so now if you paint, you can see it's going invisible. Maybe that's still too big. And I'm going to kind of do this. For hair is a good word, a good place to blend into. Probably blend into this guy right here too. Maybe I'll take off the edge of her face. And now I'm going to turn on the background picture. And it's already looking amazing. If I zoom in, you can see she's got kind of a double chin there. So I don't know if maybe doing that helps. Looks like it did. That's kind of goofy. So maybe I'll make a smaller paintbrush and try to make that go away. Clean it up. Uh, fix that because that's weird. Okay, and you're going to have to use your kind of best discretion to try to make it look real. And before you know it, it's looking better than you ever would even have known it could be possible. That's it. Okay, again, remember, you're, you're painting a, uh, a layer mask here in the middle of this picture. Okay, that's it.